Happy holiday, Arnold. Today, the planet gets clean. Leaders of all the countries have agreed to completely get rid of lithium, oil, and uranium. Now, nothing can threaten the environment. But, hmm, how are we supposed to get energy without fossil fuels? Humans use 150 petawatt hours of energy every year. To produce that much, 200 billion solar panels covering an area of 3.7 7 trillion square feet will be needed. This is 3.7% of the Sahara Desert's area. If the entire desert is covered in panels, we would get 27 times more energy than we need. But this would cost five quadrillion dollars. It's easier to solve this problem using brute force. What's that you have there, Arnie? A lithium battery. Now you, Arnie, along with all the other environmental violators, will have to generate energy yourselves. But there is one problem. If the entire population of the Earth keeps pedaling all year round without stopping, we'll only generate 10.5 petawatt hours of energy. That's just 7% of how much we need. To meet our needs, we need 125 trillion people pedaling 8 hours every day. 8 hours on the bike and your punishment is over. You moron, you didn't connect the winch. Don't you know how gravitational batteries work? If you lift a weight to a great height and then release it, the energy stored in it will be released. This energy can be converted into electrical energy. For example, to store one kilowatt, you need to lift a weight of 2,000 pounds to a height of 1,320 feet. This energy is enough to play a console game for about an hour and a half. So, the idea of getting rid of fossil fuels has been a complete failure. Now, due to this, people have turned into animals. We could have just stayed closer to nature. But now, everyone needs energy. If this video gets 10,000 likes, I'll show you other ways to get energy without harming the environment. Goodbye, Arnie.